Hi, I'm Dr. Michael Cortelli. I'm the Chief of Adult Cardiac Surgery at Memorial Regional Hospital. Heart disease in women is a very important topic. Uh, historically, women have been thought not to, to get heart disease. It's really been a disease of men. But in fact, the incidence of heart disease in women is increasing uh, every day. Uh, also, women tend to present with heart disease further along in their disease process because, again, it's it's not thought of when uh, we see women in the office or in the hospital, but also women tend to have more silent symptoms, if you will. Uh, women who are experiencing a heart attack or chest pain generally don't have that classic pain. They might have just a symptom of fatigue or a little bit of shortness of breath or just not feeling well. So generally it goes unrecognized. So we don't discover that they have heart disease until much later in their course which also leads to a uh, poor prognosis. So it's been our focus more recently. Uh, uh, the American Heart Association has had a strong campaign to uh, bring awareness to heart disease in women, and uh, that needs to continue to be delivered. That message needs to continue to be delivered uh, in order to slow the progression of heart disease in women. Uh, I think here at Memorial Regional Hospital, we have a first-class team assembled that can provide uh, cardiac surgery services to the uh, general public. What makes us special, I think, is really the quality of our team, not just the heart surgeons particularly, but uh, you know, medical personnel such as trained uh, board-certified cardiac anesthesiologists who are really expert at what they do, uh, nursing, uh, therapists, physical therapists, nutritionists, we really have a first-rate team in place that I think allows us to deliver the very highest quality of uh, cardiac surgery. Uh, we also, I feel, we're at the cutting edge of uh, cardiac surgery. We, we offer all aspects of treatment from uh, standard uh, coronary artery bypass surgery to uh, valve surgery to minimally invasive valve surgery. We also provide services such as treatment of uh, arrhythmias, particularly atrial fibrillation. And then recently we've added uh, a real expertise in aortic surgery in patients who have aortic aneurysms or emergency aortic dissections. Yeah. We feel that that really improves the overall outcomes of uh, patients after they've had something like heart surgery.